Environment Cabinet Secretary Judy Wahungu says the government is in the process of formulating and pushing for the enactment of Wetlands Regulation Bill drafted in 2009 to guide the country on sustainable wetlands management and conservation by promoting wetland wise use. Last year, we finalized the review of the Environment Management and Coordination Act Amendment 2015 to strengthen marine and inland wetland management. In addition, the National Environment Policy, the National Wetlands Management and Conservation Policy, the Integrated Coastal Zone Management Policy, and the Education for Sustainable Development Policy were all finalized. Speaking during the commemoration of the World Wetlands Day in Kericho, the cabinet secretary said the future of humanity depends on wetlands, which provide a multitude of livelihoods benefits ranging from filtering water, providing food, acting as a natural shield to protect shorelines, among other benefits. Among the benefits is support to livelihood options such as food and water, medicinal plant extraction and building materials, all of which are essential to our survival. Wetlands are major sources of water and pasture for livestock farming, which significantly contribute to the economy and to livelihoods of many of our communities. The country has been facing a challenge in managing wetlands due to massive human encroachments, something Wahungu says must be addressed urgently. The Wetlands Day is celebrated every 2nd of February to remind the world population on the importance of wetlands and this year theme was Wetlands for Our Future, Sustainable Livelihoods. Brenda Kiprono reporting for Channel 1 News Hour.